Oh, you can't. Um, if you log in at drboysprime.com, there's a list of what they call Dr. Boyce moneymakers. These are stocks that are best for selling options. Not every stock works in that same way. So uh, there are variables that you have to look for connected to things like implied volatility and stuff like that that help determine which assets are going to be the best ones to sell options on. Uh, Yvette. You mentioned if you have a capital base regarding stock options. Yeah, if you have a capital base, it's easier because the, because the capital base, it's like it's almost like if you're a chef and you're in the kitchen, you have to have ingredients. You have to have something to cook with. But if you put you can put the best chef in the world in an empty kitchen and they can't really make a whole lot. Right. So a capital base is like having food in the refrigerator. Right? It's like having something available that you can use to cook something up. Right. So the capital base is, is, is that's what that does, right? So that's why I want you to have a capital base and I want your kids to have a capital base because if you give your kids a capital base then they and, and you teach them how to cook, they're never gonna be hungry. But a lot of our kids, they don't know how to cook and they've got no food in the fridge. So if you can't cook and you ain't got no food, you're gonna starve. So if we send our kids into the world with no capital base and they don't know how to uh, do anything economically, the only skill they have is getting a job they're going to suffer. They're going to struggle. Nobody, we do not want our kids to suffer. So you got to prepare them, you know, teach them how to cook, give them something to cook with. <laughs> that's it. And in fact, that's a model we use in our Black Millionaires of Tomorrow program, the KID model, knowledge, investment, discipline. Every parent should give that to their child as a gift. You give that to your child, your child's going to soar. They're going to do great. I don't care, black, white, green, whatever. They're going to be fine. Um, so feel free to go to blackmillionairesoftomorrow.com if you want to take a look at the program. We also have financial flashcards and workbooks for kids. Uh, if you go to drboycebooks.com, drboycebooks.com, we've got tons of stuff there. Dr. Claude Anderson's books are there. My wife's stuff is in there. There's a lot of resources in there that you can take a look at. All right, so I'm going to answer a few more questions, and then I actually have to run up out of here. Uh, let's see here. Uh, where can I find a reliable trust lawyer? Um, I don't know anybody right now right offhand um, because I, you know, it depends on what state you're in. Uh, but I would, um, I mean, my parents found their trust lawyer by literally looking in the phone book and then looking at the reviews for the attorney. Uh, now remember to do an estate plan, you don't need a lawyer necessarily. Uh, you just need somebody that really understands what they're doing when it comes to estate planning. So that, that would, pro that would be the approach I would take. Um, cause I don't have anybody that I can reference to you because I, I don't know what state you're in that kind of thing. All right. So let's see here. I'm going to invest in buying cover calls weekly. I just uh, am waiting for the money to clear my bank using Robinhood. I can follow your guidance and buying puts as insurance. Now, if you talk about buying cover calls, Damien, we don't talk about buying cover calls. We sell cover calls. So remember, when you sell an asset, you're getting money in your account in exchange for what you're selling. So the selling part is the part that we um, that we focus on, not not the buying. The buying part, there's a whole options masterclass available to all the students. Um, and if you go to drboysprime.com, there's a whole stock options masterclass if you want to learn about buying options and all that. But that's more on the investment speculation side. The the other the sell side is more interesting to me because that solves an important problem that a lot of people have. How do I get enough income to pay my bills? Right. And uh, and if you have a decent capital base, it's very easy to do that. So that's that's what that what we sort of do in class. So let's see here. Uh, can you speak to the possibility of buying puts and the potential for loss if the price of the underlying stock exceeds the strike price? Yeah. So there's three types of losses generally, and I cover this more so if you log into drboysprime.com. Uh, there's three types of losses. There's paper losses, uh, opportunity cost, and then actual real losses. Um, it's important to know the difference between the three because then you can calibrate and decide which loss is more acceptable for you. And so um, if you buy puts, puts protect you against paper losses, uh, but you can also protect yourself against opportunity costs, meaning FOMO, like if the stock takes off and you miss out, right? So log in at drboysprime.com. There's a ton of information in there and a ton of lectures I've done on these topics, and, and it goes into detail to explain that. Uh, let's see here. Um, where do we look up stock? Uh, there's a lot of ways. There's a lot of places, a lot of resources online, stuff like that. Um, now I see a question here that's that's pretty long, and I do not, I do I cannot answer a question that long. So um, take that question. I don't see whose name it, uh, is next to the question, but give that question to Amani. Amani is in the chat, and she is in our support team. 
So if you email support at theblackbusinessschool.com, that's support at theblackbusinessschool.com, they can answer that question. If your questions are one or two sentences, I can answer them quickly, but super long ones are a little bit tougher because we're running out of time here. Uh, let's see here. Next question is, uh, let's see, uh, AC Salam, how do you get money out of stocks that don't pay dividends? How do you get money out of stocks that don't pay dividends? Um, well, you can sell the stock. You can sell call options on the stock. Um, that's pretty much, those are pretty much two major ways. Um, because your stock could be used as collateral or, and you could sell the call option. Um, that's pretty much it. And some, but some stocks you can't sell call options on because it's not an active market. So, uh, what do you know about the digital dollar? Um, not a ton. I know there's a lot of conspiracy theories around that. I mean, everything's going to be digitized and all that. And, you know, and there's probably some conspiracy that, you know, that the super, that government powers have to control everybody. I don't doubt that that exists, but I would not get too caught up in that. I would just adjust to what, what happens and what you see. Why would someone buy a covered call? Because they want to speculate. If they buy the call from you, they are, they are betting that the stock is going to go up. So you're selling uh, risk to someone else. You're selling the right to speculate. Uh, what do you think about copper? I think copper is a great investment. I gave you guys a copper ETF that I liked. I think what the ticker symbol was like COPEX or something like that. Um, maybe I got it wrong, but yeah, copper, copper is a great thing to invest in because there's going to be a lot of copper needed. If I'm not mistaken for either EVs or AI, I think it was AI. Yeah. I think copper demand was going to, is going to go up though. So yeah, copper investments are good. Last question. Uh, Dr. Boyce, can you also show us on your screen how to stop losses for Amazon? Not today, but uh, if you log in at the, at the black stop market program.com, we do stop loss orders in there. Uh, the black stop market program.com. The first month is free. You can try it out there. And then also uh, if you log in at Dr. Boyce prime.com, you kind of get access to everything. If options are of interest to you and you want to sell options and make money, stuff like that. Uh, that's what we do in Dr. Boyce prime.com. So uh, have a good day, everybody. And, uh, don't forget that if you want to join us for financial consciousness training, you can get on the text list. I'll send you an invitation. Uh, text the word morning to 87948. Uh, if you text morning to 87948, I will send you an invitation. All right, guys, have a good day, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.